Hey everybody, it's Hari Swaminathan from OptionTiger.com. We're looking at the SPX ticks for Tuesday's price action. As you can see, coming off of Monday, Tuesday started off very, very low. Uh, the uh, futures were down about 16 points. Uh, as the markets opened, it tried to recover, but as you can see, the ticks never really catches uh, steam on the positive sides. Besides, all of this is negative territory because it started out about 16, 17 points down. And so the only time you were looking for a trade was on the put side and uh, a small trade comes over here and then we have another small trade uh, you know right here and you would have gotten off at these bars but the real trade for uh, Tuesday was uh, was right here after this bar and then you can see that there is uh, you know the, uh, uh, there's some persistence here with uh, you know one or two green dots in the middle but that's okay as long as uh, you know as long as the ticks were moving down and below the zero line. So not a great day for the SPX ticks trading. Uh, the market started out very low, but uh, you know it sort of ended better. Let's say it, it still ended about seven point uh, seven uh, seven point seven points down. But uh, you know on, on the whole, uh, you did have a couple of small trades and maybe one good trade over here, which would have uh, netted about a thousand dollars. Thanks. The SPX ticks as well as the custom RSI are uh, custom indicators and algos. If you have any questions you can go to this bit.ly link uh, bit.ly slash spx algo and you can find more information on how to get these indicators thank you